Hello and welcome to this lesson. This is lesson 26 and it is titled Locating and Submitting to a Mentor. You see, whatever problem you are going through or whatever you want to achieve in your life or wherever you want to go in your, in your life, there are some people who have gone through that way. There are pe some people who have succeeded in that thing that is giving you headache. That, that, that field that you are exploring, some people have explored it before you came. They have made a success of their lives. They have, you know, overcome the problem. They have, you know, they have come out as winners. They have come out as success in that field of endeavor where you are having the problem. And so you must locate one or two or three of them and appoint them as your mentor. You must submit to them as your mentor. You must sometimes visit them, talk to them, learn from them, ask them questions. You know, some of the things you are going through, they are likely to have gone through some of those things. Ask them how they did it. How are they able to, you know, overcome that problem when they were going through that problem? These questions are very important. Then you need to observe these mentors, you know, how they live, how they talk, how they move. You are not going to copy them, but you want to learn from them because every one of us is, you know, we are unique. You are unique. God does not want you to be a replica of another person. But it is not a bad idea if you can learn from somebody. And you learn by observing the way the people talk, the way they behave, the way they react to situations. This matters. A mentor is going to help you. Mentors are not people you go to them to ask for money or to beg. You don't go to your mentor to beg. You go to your mentor, you know, to receive divine ideas, to receive encouragement, to receive a push, not to go and beg for money. Don't do it. Never in your life must you appoint a mentor that you go with cap in hand to beg. No. Mentors are there to inspire you and to fire you up. You need a mentor if you don't have one. It is very, very essential. Those who don't have mentors, they struggle and struggle. But those who have mentors, they have a, a soldier to lean on. Go and search for a mentor. And if you have one, make sure you maintain the relationship. It is very important. Thank you for listening. I'll see you in the next lecture.